Hello everyone welcome to hope you relate i'm really very excited and very happy for today today i'm sharing my indian kitchen tour with you all so let's enter into my kitchen the floor you can see is a tile floor and i have put this beautiful kitchen floor mat on it my kitchen is a normal medium size kitchen and has two doorways one door is towards the dining area and the other door is at the opposite end towards the gallery and the hallway My kitchen is divided into two side ways in between there is a space to stand and work on this is the inner view of my kitchen you can see this is one side on this side there is a cooking stove fridge and some counter space to work on along with different cabinets there is a small fan on the fridge top i will tell you in the later part of the video why that fan is there You can see this is my one side of the kitchen coming on towards the other side the other side has sink my dish drainer my oven and chopping board all those things are over there so let's uh, see this side first this is my cooking stove and just uh, next to the cooking stove there is a counter space to work on when i'm making chapatis when i'm starting to cook sabzi or anything i put my stuffs over here and i start working on the cooking process this is a uh, uh, the dollar tree liner which i have lined here it looks good also and also prevents the uh, counter from scratches that box that uh, spoon holder is from ikea it keeps all my spoons and uh, serving uh, things organized so uh, this is all as it looks it looks come on uh, we uh, are now doing the drawers uh, this is the drawers you can see just below the counter space this is my one drawer in this drawer all the things which i need for making chapatis this is over there jakla belan and uh, chimta and jali for making the fulkas and some atta coming on to other drawer just next to that in this drawer there are some colorful uh, leak proof uh, fluid uh, food bowls which i generally use to carry my babies food stuff when i'm going out and in base there is one dollar tree liner and i have put my rice cup over here in this drawer these are the boxes of my baby these are the rice cups you can see it is very handy to pick and measure the rice from this drawer and this is the grater for paneer and any veggies when i'm making some, some something for my daughter this i brought from india and these are the glass bowl for dessert for eating ice cream or anything so this uh, looks very uh, decorative and just next uh, below that there is one cabinet all my things which are larger in size i keep it over here my ghee olive oil box honey uh, bottle dry fruits boxes and uh, idli uh, idli stand and maggi masala packet sometimes when we are not in a mood of eating something uh, heavy and maggi is okay and uh, blender is here mixing bowls i have two three steel mixing bowls which i took from costco i keep it over here my jalis and drainers they all lie over here and on the base again there is one liner i have a stick in so it becomes very easy to take out all the things and clean this is the cooking stove these are the four coils electronic coils and these covers they are so beautiful you can see these covers i took from dollar tree and when we were doing shifting uh, we were changing the house at that time i lost two covers and right now it is 10 13 my baby is sleeping so i thought it is a right time to make the video and above there is some space i have kept my tea sugar boost and my adrak crusher and all those things over there this side of the fridge comes in direct contact with cooking so i pasted this liner over here to um, um, prevent it from any spoilage and spillings coming on towards my oven my oven is this from inside and i like to keep my oven trays inside the oven only so that um, whenever we have to use it we can just uh, put it the stuff over here just below this there is one drawer in this drawer i have kept my beautiful and uh, scenty um, candles i generally like to uh, light the candles after my cleaning is done and some extra pl plastic boxes generally there is one potluck friends coming over dinner for, to home so i have to give them or pack them something these boxes i give them so i don't have to look after my boxes comes back or not because they are not that much useful and uh, 
in this cabinet there are some extra and large bowls i uh, prefer to use it when i'm making puris or some puja is there at home and some get together is at there then i generally like to keep out them this is the cabinet which is just above the counter which i showed just to you and in this uh, all the things all the supplies all the masalas are there which are used for everyday indian cooking the first floor the first floor of this cabinet you can see my masala box is there my vegetable oil hing and anything which is needed to start the tadka which are over here let me show you the masala box this is my masaldani and in this i generally keep it refilling again and again so that whenever i am doing the cooking i just have to take it out you can see it now uh, let me show you in the base there is one dollar tree liner i have pasted over here and uh, just above to that there are some bigger boxes i have filled masalas in that whenever my masaldani gets uh, empty i keep refilling it from here this is a front view of my fridge there are some beautiful magnet we did our trips and these are the memories of those trips there is one magnetic notepad also over here you can see i generally like to write the things which gets finished in my kitchen so that i don't forget to buy them above the fridge there is one dalia or you can say there is one bowl a larger bowl in that i keep my potatoes there is one box in that i have my kept my oil that oil is extra oil after the deep frying is done i do not reuse the deep frying oil again and again i generally use uh, it next time for cooking the vegetables and this is a small fan my husband has put it over here for ventilation of the kitchen because in winters the ventilation is not that much good this is my other side of the kitchen the opposite side my sink is over here i generally like to keep my sink neat and clean and dry after my cleaning and work is done so this is my uh, sink it is so neat and clean right now because my dishes are done and this is the cabinet which is just above the sink in this cabinet all the pulses or lentils rajma chola everything they are over here so you can say that it is a protein cabinet of my kitchen you can see it it looks so colorful and healthy now uh, moving on forward let me show you the under the sink cabinet under the sink cabinet is very light i do not uh, like to over stuff it this is my cleaning supplies caddy it is a kind of diy my kitchen cleaner is there wiper is there uh, some gloves and scrub uh, bars they are there and on the base i have pasted again the dollar tree liner in this uh, polythene uh, there is some extra polythenes i have kept which i generally use for putting into the uh, dustbins or throwing my baby's diapers and uh, this is the overall view of my under the sink cabinet there is not that much space so whatever space is there i have used and i don't do not like to over stuff things which i don't use actually this is the cabinet which is just next to that as it is the cabinet just first one it is a starting cabinet so my baby generally brings her toys and hide it over here so this basically with purpose i have kept it empty and only my floor box is there and that too is tight she is not able to use it for now but in future i don't know and above that there is one drawer uh, in this drawer uh, some bowls are there some small size plates are there so basically when uh, we are eating some fruits or breakfast or any snacks so these are very handy these plates we can pick any time this is the counter space and there is my chopping board over there this is the microwave this was not going anywhere so i have organized it here above the microwave in this basket my onions are there this is my fruit and veggie chopper and other next to that is my sandwich maker so all these things are here so i have used the above the microwave space also in a nice way this is the counter space to work above the counter space there is one cabinet and in this cabinet lies my cups coffee mugs and tea cups and my foil paper foil wraps ziploc bags and all the things which are related to breakfast and my dry fruits they lies over here just above the top cabinet is empty because it's too much height height for me i do not put things over there mehndi is there in the upper cabinet in summer i will use it to put on my hair it's a very good conditioner and i have put my rubber bands and in there is a small box my coins lies over here when it gets filled i exchange the coin from the coin master from walmart and you can see in just uh, the lower cabinet there are some wheat dalia poha and 
all uh, things which are needed for breakfast let me show you my dishwasher this is my dishwasher i prefer to wash the dishes with my own hands and uh, i keep the uh, neat and clean and dry dishes into the dishwasher these are all the washed and neat and clean dishes which are ready to use and when there is a get together or parties there at home i generally like to prefer uh, those use and throw paper plates this is one drawer in this neat and clean um, dried kitchen towels my oven gloves and some tape and pens etc they are over there another cabinet is there on the downward side in this all the glass items and extra dinner wares are there and serving bowls so this is the side which is just next to the dish uh, sink and this is my dish drainer i generally like to prefer dishes with my own hands i wash and keep them here for drying just back to it this is a very good organizer a lot of my friends who come to ha my house they ask from where you have taken it i took it from target and this has various cabinets my spoons my scapulas my baby's spoons and brush scissor forks everything is organized nicely so whatever we have to take we can take it and this is the cabinet just above to that dish drainer in this cabinet all the plastic wares lies and my husband's tiffin boxes and you can see this is a goldfish box i am using it to organize my lids so it's very easy to pick any lid and pick the box and fit it so thank you very much guys for watching this video and i hope you really liked it please subscribe to my channel and like this video i am a new youtuber thank you